Today's game is coming to you live from Hexon, Texas at the raucous AK-47 Stadium, home of the $10 Bible beer and bullet combo meal. The crowd is armed, overzealous, and drunk, so basically a normal Sunday here in Hexon. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Atlanta Vultures take on the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. <laughs> and it's first and ten. are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score and it's first and ten hot, hot one hot two hot. and he just wrestles away from that tack you ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim nope well i have on several occasions not surprising multiple times on each occasion not surprising and trust me that it was what? Oh, this berserk dirty trick it. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Ah, oh, that was a close one. Pow, with the brain scrambler. Bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. It's good. Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. down in a mile. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down in a mile. Oh, that was a great throw and a great catch. Yeah, but, but it was an interception. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him ten yards right there. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hot two. Hot three. And that's another pick. Man, 
Oh, man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. Well, good luck. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Yeah. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Nice run there for eight yards. Second down and two. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot two. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. And he breaks away. Touchdown! System, but I see your point, Bricks. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. First and ten. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. what it feels like to hit oh mama just call him cap and crunch another one bites the dust <laughs> and it's first and ten hot, hot one hot two hot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Boom!
And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and long. He picks up five on that play. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. Well, that's a lovely shank for the punter today. He just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. He rifled it. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. Second down in inches. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Looks like a pass. And receiver explodes. And everyone on both sidelines looks very angry. Yeah, he owed him a lot of money from what I hear, Tim. Like a lot. How much? Second down in a lot. And he's off to the races. He's running out of gas now. He refuses to go. He's at the 40. And he held on to that one for a first down. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. First and ten. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And, and they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point in the game. I won't listen to this blast for me. Right rage ignites that deep down violent rage. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. Oh, my God. Just like the 4th of July, only with blood and guts. Now the offense seems to think the defense had too much time on their hands, so they took some of it back with a time warp dirty trick. That last play was completely erased from time. You know, I, I use that kind of power to, like, unnuke the world. But that sure, getting rid of a play works, too. <laughs> and that'll bring up second and one. QB know which team he's on? I don't even know why I'm at. Oh, what a brutal hit. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. And it's first and ten. Down. Get 
give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Do what? The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw intercept. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Hey, man, I was hitting on the panel now. Oh, my God. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar. I mean... Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Ah, another interception. Give this if that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick at it. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I had to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. That was a good throw, assuming he was aiming for the ground. Third down and never gonna happen. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB, oh, with the punishing hit. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know. I hate those zebra men. Third down, and defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and ten. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Second down and ten. Ball to 
explode, and the defensive player got blown to bits. <laughs> Down and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. First and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Oh, devastating. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a... And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That one's incomplete. The receiver couldn't get there. And yeah, neither could his mother. Second down and ten. What is this, Andy's wrestling? Third down and, well, good luck. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and one. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. <laughs> now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. 
What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It's good. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Ma, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turn on the light, it was... No doubt about it. That guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Well, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. The QB says, I don't know almost throw interceptions, but oh, that's a vicious hit. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. <laughs> and it's first and ten. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! Second down and nine. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new... And he's off to the races! Look at that little mutant run! Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim! <laughs> First down and one. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. And that'll bring up second and one. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, it's probably evident. This guy's a brick shithouse. And he's running like a moose right now. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. Second down and six. Third down and nine. but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Oh, no good. Now that punter's gonna have no return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Another NSC. 
exception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined, you'd expect him not to play like total shit. No argument. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 I mean, and the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for it. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. <laughs> QB is saying his prayers. Hot one, hot two, hot. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. And the defense calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Then I'll make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. And that'll be second down and four. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? And the two-minute warning sounds. Sounds like what, Grim? Sounds like the asshole I'm living on. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. The quarterback passes the ball, and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like... And it's a miss. Looks like the QB had some issues with the ball placement. Spikes out. Spikes out. How many times do you have to tell that idiot QB to hold the ball with the spikes out? Hot one, hot two, hot three. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh my gosh! Boom, get him down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's gonna kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. Back in 2017, they started implementing extreme alien betting, and you can see how well it all worked out. Man, it was just trying to make America great again, Grim. Lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. They're lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot 
One. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Oh, nice hit. <laughs> First and ten. Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. Why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pitchkin? Bacon! I'm hungry for bacon! Wall. With the vicious kill! Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! First down and five. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but... This guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two. Hot and there's an eight yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now, like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. The offense goes into their two minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing in the hurry up offense, you moron. I am so confused. The defender blows up the receiver on the play and knocks the ball loose. The Hickson Oilers win the game today. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm-hmm, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every...